This question comes from Nicholas, who asks, As a writer, I'm wondering what would be the cumulative energy of the hundreds of thousands of keystrokes required to write a novel? You probably shouldn't invest in a keyboard-based generator anytime soon. People like figuring out places where we can recover seemingly wasted energy. It's a great goal, but sometimes it's hard to judge how much energy is actually moving around in a particular system. Cool sounding ideas like solar roads don't always work out when you run the numbers, while other ideas for collecting waste, like recovering the energy from cars braking, turn out to be totally practical. In the case of keyboards, there's a lot of engineering research into the force required to press keys, in part because so many people suffer from repetitive strain injuries. Using data from a study of rubber dome keyboards, we can estimate that the energy required to press a key is around 1.5 millijoules for a letter key and 2.5 for a big key like enter or spacebar. How much is 1.5 millijoules? Well, it's enough to heat a drop of water by 1% of a degree. It's also enough to lift a squirrel 300 microns, all the way from the ground to the top of a stack of four sheets of paper. Now that we know how much energy a key press takes, we need to figure out how many key presses are involved in writing a novel. A typical novel might have half a million to a million characters in it, so typing it out would require at least that many key presses. The amount of backspacing and rewriting varies wildly from person to person. Some people write straight through without pausing or editing, while others rewrite every sentence endlessly. It turns out not to make a big difference which kind of writer you are. If you write straight through without editing, you'd expend about a kilojoule. With a lot of rewrites, you might expend several kilojoules, but you'd need to rewrite every word 10 times to match the energy stored in a single AA battery. Writing one full novel would provide enough energy to run a laptop for a total of about 30 seconds. If each novel takes you six months, you'd spend two seconds out of every million running off keyboard power. A novel every six months seems like a lot of typing, but plenty of people type more. The site WhatPulse offers tools to track mouse clicks and keystrokes and hosts a community of users who post their statistics online and compete with each other to accumulate the highest totals. WetPulse has been running for over 20 years, and some users have logged over 400 million cumulative key presses. A heavy WetPulse user types the equivalent of one novel every two months, and some of them manage a novel every few weeks. But there are even speedier keyboard users. If you abandon the requirement of writing actual words and just care about the most key presses, eSports is a promising place to look. Top eSports professionals can clock in over 400 actions per minute, which are a mix of mouse clicks and keystrokes. Taking a conservative estimate, a top eSports player types the equivalent of a novel in a few days of playing time. However, a few days still isn't fast enough to represent much energy. Remember, to keep a laptop running from key press power alone, you'd need to write a novel in half a minute. To run a microwave would require one novel per second. Even for the fastest typists, writing is not a novel form of exercise.